It is 913 on this Saturday morning. A lot of my early birds woke up to a beautiful sunrise. This was the view from surprise. Mark sharing this to our Arizona's Weather Authority Facebook group. Also seeing a lot of pictures from that bush, uh, that brush fire that was in the Southwest Valley last night. This morning we're seeing beautiful blue sky from Sedona Airport. It's going to be a warm day there, but we do have a gradual cooling that is going to begin today. And valley highs, believe it or not, by Tuesday are going to be in the upper 90s. Normal for this time of year is right around 106. Uh, Sunday, Monday, though, we are going to have critical fire weather, and that's because we're expecting strong winds, low humidity. We already have a lot of dry fuels in place. We haven't had rain for a couple of months, and no rain is expected uh, really this week, although we could see some isolated thunderstorms across eastern and southeastern Arizona, but they should be relatively dry. Temperature wise right now, we're up to 92 in Phoenix. It's 76 in Flagstaff, 79 for Sholo right now, 94 for Lake Havasu, 95 for Gila Bend and 90 in Kingman. Around the state will be in the mid 80s today for Flagstaff, upper 70s though tomorrow. Cooling for Payson with 91 today, but 87 tomorrow. Uh, we are going to drop about six degrees between today and tomorrow in Sedona with highs in the mid 90s today, low 90s tomorrow in Pine Top. We'll see highs in the low 80s today in the upper 70s tomorrow with breezy winds today. Gusty winds come tomorrow. Satellite radar shows we have a weak disturbance. It's moving through our state that helped produce uh, some of that Virga rain that's evaporating before it hits the ground across southeastern Arizona. Otherwise, the rest of the state is going to stay pretty dry. And our seven day rain outlook shows only a little bit of rain across the southeast corner of our state. Really not seeing much semblance of the monsoon just yet. Uh, looking at the longer range forecast, we do have a trough of low pressure that's uh, right around the Pacific Northwest and as we head into Sunday Monday that's going to start to sag southbound as it does we're going to see our pressure gradient tightening up these isobars these lines you see when they get pretty tightly packed that tells us it's going to be pretty windy and breezy across our state. Uh, this system is also going to usher in some cooler air that's going to drop those temperatures each day for at least the first half of next week and we aren't expecting any rain with this storm. Looking at the wind speeds for today, they'll peak right around 6 p.m. and we'll see wind sustained at about 15 to 20 miles per hour across northern Arizona. In the valley, we'll see wind sustained at 10 to 15 miles per hour, all coming out of the southwest. Winds will die down tomorrow morning and then by tomorrow late afternoon and into the evening hours. We'll see stronger winds sustained of 25 to 30 in northern Arizona and for our southern deserts of 15 to 20 miles per hour. Our high for today 107. Again, that's close to average. Average is 106. The record 118 that was set back in 1990. We'll be at 106 today for Mesa, 103 for AJ, 107 for Chandler, 107 for Goodyear. Surprise at 104 today. Looks like 105 for Deer Valley and 101 for Free. Your extended forecast shows temperatures come down a few degrees each day. Sunday only 105, Monday only 100. Morning lows drop to the 70s. Tuesday double digit delight, 98 degrees for that high. Uh, we do stay cooler than average though through Thursday.